I'm Dr. Mike Milligan. We're here at the Hinman Dental Meeting, so there's a little background noise. But I'm here at the cable booth with Steve Sage. Steve, thanks for being with us. Thank you, Dr. Milligan. <laughs> well, you really uh, need, if you don't have a diagnosis, you need some. Now, I've got three in my own office, and I've got Steve here to tell us all about the diagnosis. Steve, tell us about the diagnosis. Well, it's a laser caries detector generally designed to replace your explorer when you're inside the mouth just trying to find a K. Right. If you think about it going back, there's been no advancements in, laser, in caries detection except the explorer for years. And back in 2000, we came out with our first model that was known as the Classic. Yes. And we, the original design of it was going after the pedo market, oh. trying to find the K in, in kids, yeah. you know, for uh, replacing sealants and things like that. Then along came 2006, we came out with our cordless model, the pen. When did the first one come out? In 2000. 2000, yeah. this was 2006. 2006, okay. correct. And we use uh, laser caries, or laser fluorescence to find decay. Okay. So the way it works is it shoots a little diode laser uh -huh. that's you know weaker than the laser pointers that you see out there okay. that reflects yeah. off a tooth and uh, healthy tissue fluoresces differently than decay does. Okay. And that's the whole basis behind it. Very simple, but very, very accurate. It is accurate. And, and, uh, and I want to say that because I found it to be very accurate. Sometimes when I didn't think there was something there, there was. And when I thought there was something there, there wasn't. Exactly. Uh, but the laser will tell you, it's just a better service for the patient. You, you know, in, in my practice, I see, you see stain in the tooth. Well, you don't know how deep that is. Sometimes it's deep, sometimes it's not. You don't need to treat it or you can seal it. Correct. And so, uh, uh, you know, I, had, I say, Julie or Lily, go ahead and use the diagonal on these areas and let me know what your reading is. Exactly. It promotes very, very conservative dentistry it because does. it finds everything from the very infancy stage all the way up and it gives you a little number assigned to it that tells the severity inside the tooth. Right, so you can not only find things that need to be treated that you might not have treated, uh, but also you can treat them sooner. Absolutely. Because you catch it faster. Right, and, right. And you know that it's decay there soon. Yep, very, very conservative. <clears throat> Fantastic. Well, um, what's the cost of one of these units? The retail cost of it is about $3,100. Okay. Um, you can get them through your local distributor. Okay, and uh, through your local distributor, and it's a cable product. Correct. So. Um, Let's see, $3,100, so you can see that it's not going to take too many restorations to be uh, cost-effective for you. And Absolutely. That very quickly. Well, the, the feedback that we get, I mean, number one, it's, it's all about patient care. Absolutely. However, the feedback that we get from the field out there is that it will pay for itself in usually a month or two. That was my experience. Yeah, exactly. I mean, if you think about how much decay is being missed by your explorer trying to find a stick, not find a stick, watch it. Yeah. How much decay is being missed out there? Yeah. Yeah. You think about if you find one extra thing a day, um, it'll pay for itself in a big hurry. And the patients are impressed with that too, saying we've got this laser cavity detector. Correct. And they don't right. question it. If the laser says uh, it's there, I've never had a patient question it yet. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, so fantastic. Well, anything else you'd like to tell us about the, the diagonal state? Um, on our cordless model that we have right here, we just developed, this is brand new, um, we just developed a wireless Bluetooth console right here. So when you are inside the mouth, um, you can take your readings and you'll actually get your readings show up on this Bluetooth monitor over here. So okay, it's, it's the original design, again, is for the operator, so they can see the uh, values as they fluctuate, but also it, it interacts with the patient as well, because the patient will see the, the values as well. Great, well, very good. Well, Steve, thanks so much. Absolutely, All right. great. As I mentioned, Dr. Milligan, these are the two models that we offer. Our classic model came out in the year 2000. It is a corded battery pack operated model. Um, in 2006, we developed our first cordless version. The display um, readings are right on the handle of it. And then last year, we just introduced a Bluetooth model, um, a Bluetooth display that sends a cordless signal from our cordless version down here to the display. Um, they both use a little diode laser 
that you run through a quick step of calibration because your tips are removable and autoclavable. So you're gonna do a quick little calibration step to both models that's very, very simple. You'll press the menu button, press the enter button. You wait for the little calibration or the little uh, audio tone to come on. Put it right in the middle of the calibration disc until the audio tone stops and you're done. So it's about a three second step. Then you go straight to your patient. You do what's referred to as setting a baseline on the patient. So you get a very, very exact reading from recall to recall with the same patient. You usually just find an anterior tooth, come in contact with it, press your hold button until you hear the double beep, and then you're live, ready to go. You just work your way around the tooth surface, similar to what you would do with the, an Explorer, and you will, as soon as you hit a certain level of decay, you'll get a digital readout right here on your uh, display unit, which will show up on the console as well. Very, very simple, very fast. It takes no more time than uh, using an Explorer throughout the mouth.